explicitly told because of my gender I was not allowed in certain rooms, in certain organizations. compelling things that I found in my research that are highlighted in the upcoming book that I've co-authored. Uh, it's called uh, Entrepreneurial Ecosystems, a Gender Perspective, is trying to understand how we have come to value entrepreneurship as one of the most important drivers of the economy and how we've come to support it in so many ways, but we still are leaving so many people behind, especially women entrepreneurs. So our premise was trying to understand the complexity of how this unequal playing field happened and trying to figure out ways in which maybe we can address those challenges. So one of the things that the book does is to provide a holistic framework for understanding that it's not simply about the individual trying harder, pitching better, uh, engaging in different things that she should be doing. She is not broken. The system is broken. So we provide a complex way of thinking about the individual, the organizations, and the institutions involved in supporting entrepreneurship and how uh, together they can create um, a new way of supporting entrepreneurship that's much more gender inclusive. The other highlight from the book is that we coined something called ecosystem identity, looking at different ecosystems to support entrepreneurship across different cities and find some of them are simply better organized towards uh, achieving gender inclusion and gender equity than others. The ones that are much more established actually have a much more difficult time than the ones that are new and emergent that have the possibility of um, putting things in place that will continue to uh, provide opportunities and equal access for women.